Hi, and welcome to Girl Talk. We are here at Orange Theory today with our good friends Taylor from Programs for Exceptional People. Of course, Miss Kelly is here. She worked us last time here in Lens. And I wouldn't know. I know, exactly. <laughs> we just gave Erin a hard time because it's, we had, yeah. it was one of the best shows I think we've ever yeah, done because we participated in the Orange Theory Fitness. Now, Miss Taylor, you've never been here. I haven't. What I got think? kind of like a little tour when I came in and got some information. It, it looks oh, really cool. and. You know, I feel like everyone's just really motivated when they're all together and someone's leading them. So I like that idea. Yeah. I think it's a lot of fun. You wore your like I'm ready to work out outfit. I today. know. I'm, I'm getting taking baby steps, Debbie. All right. We were talking about what are we going to talk about today? Because it's an open discussion. And what did you say? You both had the same idea. New year. New, new year. year. New year. New Never you. too late to reinvent yourself. Exactly. <laughs> Somebody told me the other day they wanted to retool themselves, and I thought that was kind of a neat way to look at it too. What do you do for New Year? Do you find that people make resolutions and? Yeah, you know, we don't like to. Resolutions is kind of an, uh, passe. you know, passe yeah. because so a decade it's ago. It's just setting yourself up for <laughs> failure. Okay. You know, so you really don't want. You do want to set goals. Um, and make them smaller goals. You know, resolutions are very lofty. Usually, saying this year I'm going to do this. Yes. And when's the New Year start? New Year's Day after everybody's been out. New Year's Eve. So you know. Aren't there statistics <laughs> to back up the fact that um, places of exercise, et cetera, et cetera, in January everyone starts, and then yes. by what March first, three quarters of them have kind of. They they kind of they kind of can fall out, but. The, Really cool thing here at Orange Theory is we have these wonderful um, people that you know at the desk, um, the sales associates that make you know they keep everybody accountable. Yes. So they really keep track, and we want to know. We want to make sure everybody's okay and every, keep them all motivated. So if you haven't seen someone in a week or especially two weeks, we start calling and oh texting, God, saying, "Hey, where are you? Is everything <laughs> what the heck? Is everything <laughs> okay? We miss you." And they'll, we get texts back all the time saying. Thank you so much. Are you, you are awesome. Awesome. Want, You crave that though, right? Yeah. You want accountability. Yes, you do. Kind of, you yeah. do. Get you moving. Yeah. Yeah. Are you a worker out of room? I'm not. <laughs> I want to be. I coach cheerleading right now. That's so, right. Yeah. So having the You're two working jobs, out some kids. Yeah. And we do stunting and everything. So it is, you know, kind of a workout. But after that, it's over. I would really like a class like this. Oh but my gosh, for I them, you want to do for exactly. you. Exactly. Yes. Yeah. Good point. I was so intimidated when I first came. We talk about we this. We both on, were. Right? I didn't even know where I was. I was like, am I at Disney World? <laughs> am I at a frozen yogurt place? It's just so cool and it's bright. It's exciting, and though. Like, the vibe I feel like is very are boring. cool here. And I, it, the vibe is cool, but and actually participating, I realize now that what uh, Kelly kept saying was, never worry. Everything is done at your own pace. Right. Mm -hmm. There's With no pressure to all levels, compete. all abilities, all ages. Yeah. Somebody who hasn't exercised in forever. Somebody so we who's can maybe do it never together next to one so. another. Yeah. I love that. <laughs> it's actually a lot of fun. And we're the music's fun, and oh, you can hear the coaches yeah. are very motivated. I know it sounds like we're in a club. Working. <laughs> but but they don't yell at you. It's, no, it's they very don't. motivating. You know, encouraging. They yeah, really yeah. are. We're going to take a quick break. We're going to come back. Again, we're here at Orange Theory. There's a lot more to talk about. Stay with us. We're back here on Girl Talk. We're having a great time during our break. We're just sort of like moving to the groove. All right. You got so much going on here at Orange Theory. Always. And I think one of the things that you'll love, Taylor, about Orange Theory is every single time we're here, there's either an event, a community a fundraiser. That's right. Yeah, a special that. promotion. They mm -hmm. play well with others. Yeah. Little hints. <laughs> as a nonprofit, I love to hear that. <laughs> we do, we do. And that's, you know, one of the things that drew Orange Theory to me was not just the workout and the science behind it and the community. Um, but um, Orange Theory is a corporate business, is also a big fundraiser. Okay. So every year, every studio takes yeah. part for Augie's Quest, which uh, raises money um, for uh, ALS. Okay. So, um, but, and then they're very encouraging for other studios to get involved. Like um, last month, we um, had our members bring in canned goods, and for every 
canned good they brought in or non-perishable, everything right. they brought in, each piece was a ticket, a burpee that the coach had to do and they could assign oh, what coach funny. did burpees. That's so um, we kept <laughs> mean. You know, somebody <laughs> came in. in box. <laughs> AJ who's coaching right now, I think he had 83 and so we did it. We did a tape of it and it's going to go on our Facebook page of the coaches doing them. Um, but this month we're doing the toy drive for Deepwell, yes. and we have a ton of toys over there. Our members have just been so generous. Well, in our next segment will be fun for you because you'll get to hear about programs for exceptional people, and I think I can just see a lot of that was a great connection. Yeah, yeah. Right. I think it really is. What yeah. do you have coming up for the new year? Well, we have some very exciting things. Right now we have a promotion going on for our packages. Okay. It's 10, 20, and 30 packages. Um, you get some extra classes when you buy those. So pop on in and um, talk to our lovely uh, girls at the front desk. And then um, next month, we have our transformation challenge again. Ooh. So that is incredible. Those our first one we me. did. <laughs> this is very good. This is eight weeks. You sign up. You mm -hmm. have to be accountable. You participate. You um, three times a week. You have to be in class three times a week. Okay. You do a, a beginning way, a midway, and an end way. Do you have and goals? Then there's, you, in each? you can set goals. Okay. Um, and Survival. You have, you're, um, yeah. I'm just wondering. Like at your the end, are people really transformed? Oh, oh yes. Oh, oh yeah. Okay. And there's a cash prize for the top male and female and a second and third prize. And last transformation challenge, it ended up being a husband and wife that won. That's cute. Oh, that's and cool. Th I think they lost collectively something like 35 or 38 pounds. Oh, I definitely need to come that, here. Oh, do you find that most people want to lose weight, get healthy, stay in shape? It's all of the above. Okay. Um, you know, um, and when somebody comes in to talk about the program or to find out about it, um, our um, front desk people, the sales associates, will go over. We have a wonderful sheet that asks about their goals, yes. past um, exercise, what they, you know, injuries, anything like that. And they just go through everything, and then the coaches study that. And they really get to know the members um, very, very well. And, um, you know, and then they give them options of what to do in there if they have challenges or restrictions. It's funny, when we've talked to people, they say it, it becomes almost like a family. It does. I mean, it oh, yeah. Like a, very much so. Kind of nice. It's a little clicky, but in a good way. No, <laughs> it's not clicky, though. It's very, very well, opening. You know, I just see people wearing the, the logo, yeah. and, you know, I kind of feel like I'm not the cool kid. <laughs> well, well, there, there is that. that. You know, my brother-in-law is always walking around with his, you know. Oh, his he's, Because he's achieved so many different yeah. challenges. Challenges, yes. so you know. Make well, just look out for January. We <laughs> have some re we have a really exciting thing for the transformation challenge that uh, we can't really announce yet. But oh, um, don't you like? Yeah, we, you guys would love to know, but whoops, we can't share. I can't share it yet. But there's some exci really exciting things coming up uh, for this next year for Orange Theory and for our studio. How often do you have classes? Are you open? I was going to ask that yeah. too. We're every day, open okay. every day. The one day we're closed in the year is Christmas Day. Okay, well. Um, and then on holidays, we goodness. have, you know, a shortened schedule, usually like our Saturday schedule for classes. Okay. But otherwise, Monday through Thursday, we, we have classes running from 5 a.m. to um, that was my 6.45. Okay. And then Fridays, a little earlier we close because, you know, this island on Fridays. Yes, exactly. They're kind of like, okay, because <laughs> yeah, yeah. lunch time, I'm gone. Right. And And um, then Saturdays and Sundays were very, very busy as well. So, oh, And coming into these holidays with the cross-regionals, because you can use this membership at any oh, Orange yeah, area around the country. Anywhere. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We'll have My a brother lot like, coming here. Oh, he, does he? That's the first thing he looks oh, for. Oh, yeah, he goes, he goes after all he the books the hotel. Time. He's like, Orange He's theory. like, where's my Orange Theory? We're going to take a quick break, and we're going to connect these two, so stay with us. <laughs> we are back. Okay, I just have to call her out for one second. Did you notice how when Kelly got up, she went, oh. <laughs> yeah. so, what? This quick uh, 12 days of fitness? So we had the 12 days of fitness, which was December 1st through December 12th. And every day had a challenge in it and kind of had a theme, kind of like Hell Week, if you right. remember talking about that. And uh, so yesterday was 12 squats descending. So it was squats, squats, Gosh. squats, squats, and 
we've done burpee days and you know oh so it was God. a little so like really <laughs> <is>. <laughs> exactly. she can hardly sit good. down but she looks really good exactly. <laughs> it's a good it was yeah, a good look good. Exactly. exactly so all good. right let's talk about programs for exceptional people and i really am excited to kind of connect you to because i think it could be a really positive yeah. thing talk a little bit about what you're doing you've got the new building but i also want you to share with kelly a little bit about programs yeah. for exceptional people so we provide day program services for adults in Beaufort and Jasper counties who live with intellectual disabilities. Mm -hmm. uh, so they come to our program during the day. Uh, we offer them employment opportunities and recreation and leisure opportunities. There's always lots going on. Um, like I said, it's all adults. Um, it's a great and, program. Oh, yeah. I just love it. Do you it. remember that when, do you remember oh, yeah. Pep? Yeah, exactly. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. She's been around And for, it started yeah. on the island, didn't oh, it? Oh, yeah. 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 yeah, 1995. Right, um, exactly. So this is the first time we're, you know, transitioning into Bluffton. Because um, actually, it's about 74% of our members now live off island. Oh, wow. So it kind of makes sense for us to wow. make the move to Bluffton, and that area is just growing so much. How many much. members are there? 63. Wow. And, and growing right. every every month. And they just and she's marketing. So it's the first time you guys have really put a full court press in getting all of this information out. We've met members. They have a retail store. Oh, really? Yes, our ceramic store. Um, oh, yes, I've read about that. Yeah, so it's oh, a really cool place. Good marketing, see? She <laughs> does. Yeah. I'm glad you heard about it. Um, <laughs> after the first of the year, we're all going to be in one building, and it's a building we purchased back in May at uh, 39 Sheridan Park Circle in Bluffton. So all of our programs and services will be under one roof, which is just going to be so much easier for the staff, members, everyone involved. Um, but we still will have, you know, our ceramic store within that building. So, so that cool. program is, you know, staying so the same. Things. Yeah, exactly. So lots of exciting things happening, and we're just, you know, really, really excited and relieved that it's finally happening. Yes. Like I said, we we bought that in May, so it's been a constant discussion on Girl Talk, and I can finally announce that. Exactly. <laughs> do you do a lot of holiday activities and with the participants and the members? Yeah, we've had a lot going on. Uh, we did participate in the Bluffton Christmas Parade oh, uh, a couple cool. weekends ago, so we had a really cool float that Kara designed. Yeah. Uh, so she did oh, awesome. I can only imagine. Oh, I need gosh. a picture of that. She's <laughs> yeah, look on our Facebook page. I posted lots of pictures. Uh, it looked really cool. Oh, cool. Mm -hmm. So, uh, besides that, I think they're having a Christmas party next week, uh, making some Christmas cookies. I know they made ginger house, gingerbread houses uh, oh, so yesterday. Fun. So, Where yeah. are some of the places that um, your folks work? They work at Carrabba's, Riley's, Hilton Head Hospital, and Osprey Thrift Store. And then we have our micro businesses that are run solely by PEP. And we have our ceramic store, our lawn and home care service, our print shop, and then an ergonomics product manufacturing What's that? Job. How cool. Uh, so we partner with a local, a local Fortune 500 company. Is that the Gulfstream project? It is. Um, What's it called? Gulfstream. Oh, Gulfstream project. You remember yeah. those cool yes. um, yes. footrests? Yes, and they make footrests. They make air clamps for the technicians and what they're called like creeper chairs for mechanics and technicians. Wow. So and they're recycling oh. products. Exactly. And then oh, repurposing cool. them. Listen yep, they to donate you. All you the go, girl. I took notes. <laughs> yeah. Where were you? <laughs> I, I know. <laughs> I think I missed that one. That sounds really cool. It is yeah, very cool. it's a really cool opportunity for them to work with their hands, yeah, and really I mean, amazing. it really costs it's nothing for us, cool. and we get the proceeds and everything, so it works out great. Now, can we just drop by the new building once you're oh gosh, in there and open? Yeah, and I've been working there for you know seven or eight months now, so you guys can come in anytime. Come here. Yeah, we'll drag you in. It's in there. Fun. Yeah, yeah. It, that's it looks it looks really good. Um, you know, we had to do some construction uh, to receive our state and local licensing and everything, but mm -hmm. everything is finally coming together, and we just couldn't be more excited. Well, you guys deserve it. You that's well, been a lot you. of effort and work, yeah. labor of love. Been. Exactly, exactly. We're going to take a quick break, and then I think we're going to go on a field trip. So stay with us here on Girl Talk.